Alright guys, ADHD here, back with another video and another neck brace because today I'm still injured and you'll have to just get used to this for the next couple weeks here and yes, I did wear this shirt on purpose because it's, it's been accurate the last couple days here. But on the last depressing note for me, today is going to be a very good day, well it's a, it's a mixed day because I had a friend that came over here and broke the claw machine. So basically we have a claw machine, you guys saw the video, but it's broken, like the claw machine doesn't work. So I decided, well... You know, it was a rickety machine in the first place, and it's probably not worth getting fixed, and it, there's a lot of different reasons why. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna destroy it! We're gonna break it, and we're gonna just decide to take a little bite off that what that channel with that dad and his son, what's inside, whatever yet. We're gonna try and do that too, we're gonna try and show you guys what's inside of a claw machine at the same time. But most importantly, we're gonna try and break it, have some fun with the animals inside of it, and do all types of stuff as usual. So what we're gonna do, just start on that right now, but that's another thing to show you guys, really, really cool stuff to show you in a second though. I'll get over there and show you in a second, but you guys have been asked for this thing to come back, so here we go. We're gonna go ahead and go for it right now. Right now on your guys' screen are three different options. I don't know when the next time you'll see this again, one of these different, you know, games like this. So it might be a while. So enjoy. Hit the like button if it ends in an even number, an odd number, or a zero at the end of your like or your view. This is what you get of these three options. Right now, there is a claw that is above every single one. And whichever one you get is what prize you get. You're gonna be revealed what prize you have in three, two, Hopefully you got something decent. Let me know down below. What did you guys win from the prize screen? Did you win something good or did you win something terrible? Let me know down below. But anyway, let's get started with the walking 3, 2, 1 camera flip. Kind of forgot that. Boop. Hey, what you doing, bro? Hey, man, I'm here to see the Reptar wall, man. The Reptar wall? Oh, you yeah. in TV Cribs? Oh, I'm in TV Cribs. You know I'm in TV Cribs. Oh, right, welcome to my crib. All right. You guys want to see the reptile wall? The reptile wall is coming up right now. That reptile wall is right in here. Here it is. I'll show you guys it in a couple seconds. All right, so you guys have been sending reptile fan art for a long time, but I started actually getting some of the best artwork and actually putting it on this wall right here. I'm gonna show you in a second, but I need more because we're not finished. I want to make this whole wall completely full. We have a very small section done. Let me turn another light on. I'll show you guys it right now. All right, so here we go. Here's the reptile wall. Dang. Yeah. It's the Reptar wall, man. The Reptar wall. <laughs> this thing is sweet. You guys drew all this stuff. Some of my favorites that I put in actually in frames. They need to be adjusted a little bit. But I put in actual frames right here. We have this one. And if you guys see your artwork on the wall, let me know in the comment section down below. We have some awesome stuff you guys have sent in. But, Parker, you see all this? That wall you're rubbing? This needs something. And it's not me. <laughs> it needs more Reptar. So what I need you guys to do is if you haven't sent it before, I need you guys to send some fan mail Reptar. I'm calling you guys out. I need you to do. I know there's some artists out there. I know if you're not an artist, just make something. You know, there's some really cool stuff you can make. And it has to be filled in, guys, because I want it to be like a big wall of just green. So I need you guys to actually color it in, too, because look, this one's not colored in, but most of them are colored in. So I need you guys to color them in as well. Send them over to the P.O. Box, and it's on screen right now again. Make sure you guys send something over. Reptar wall it needs to be completed. All right, so now we're going outside to check out the machine, and we're also be breaking into some other stuff. But as of recently, safety is our number one priority. Boom. So, <laughs> if you get the reference, you get it. But, I have some glasses. Some new, these are my special spectacles now. These are the glasses that protected my eyes from the inferno. So from now on, these are my official glasses. Let me know down below how I can make these glasses look cooler. I'm gonna edit them or mess with them. Special spectacles. Special spectacles. I can see through you. And your lies! So you can see that there's nothing. I see how cold hearted you really are. I see the lack of empathy in you. I see everything. I know what you did in middle school. Oh no. <laughs> So now we're gonna go side, and we're gonna look at the machine, and we're gonna go from there. Come on. So right, right here we have the machine, and it does not work anymore. It does not work. Somebody came over here. I'm a friend of Parker and I's. Came over here and broke it. They didn't know because the machine it could not go past like halfway. So he just forced it over there, and it broke. So therefore, now we have no claw machine. I wanted to do a challenge video with it. I wanted to do some other stuff with it, but we can't now. So now we have one option. And that's to get out of here. And the only way it's getting out of here is in a body bag. So what we gotta do is we gotta break it down. All right, we're gonna plug it in uh, just because we want to see make one sure one one last time. Make sure it does. Not work. It does turn on, but it doesn't work. Work though. So let's just see. 
Nope, Jesse. It's like, what's wrong, guys, is the claw actually doesn't go down and grab. And if you guys look in here, there's all, it's like this, somebody makeshift this thing. Like, it broke a long time ago, and they just put some glue and some stuff and just really rigged it up together. So, I'm not surprised it doesn't work, but let's just see if we can get to work today. It's even moving slower than last time. It moves, but the claw never goes down. It's officially broken. I'm, I'm sure there's some way we can like desperately fix it, but it didn't work that well in the beginning. So we're just gonna just go ahead and say goodbye to the challenge R, and we're gonna go ahead and destroy it today. But before we do that, I wanna show you guys actually how a claw machine works. What's inside this piece right here? And then I wanna show you guys me breaking this glass open. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're gonna start off. Oh, also, over there, excuse me, machine. That's the, the game machine. I will be, there'll be an update on that video. A lot of guys have been asking about it, uh, you know, seeing updates on it. That is still being worked on, but I have very, very, very good news in the soon, soon future that I'll be sharing with you guys on that thing. I know a lot of guys want updates on it. I will have an update very, very soon once I'm 100% sure everything's going good. But I may have, you know, going to be a little action, a little gameplay. I don't know. Gameplay? Yeah, you'll see. So I'll right. wait up for that. If you're, not, if you're new here, subscribe. Do I have to wait? You have to wait, too. Everybody's got to wait. Oh, man. So, what do you think this is? I like maybe not wait. Do you think you're above other people? All of a sudden, I don't think I'm. You get some car I, army shorts, I'm, I'm, and all of a sudden, let's show them the shorts. I don't, don't want to show them the shorts. Show them the shorts. No, they can't see them anyway, right? Show them the shorts. I, are you sure? Yep. He gets some army shorts, and all of a sudden, he thinks he's above you guys. He thinks he's above everybody. He thinks he's above me. He thinks he's above anybody. And I don't know what this guy's problem is. All right, so what we're gonna do is I'm not, you know, I'm not a claw machine expert. I mean, I'm a claw playing it. I'm an expert at playing it, but not necessarily an expert on the machine. Where you didn't even win. I won a lot of things, but not the claw machine. So, what we're gonna do is show you guys exactly what I do know about it. I'm actually figured out a lot of it because I'm trying to fix this thing. So, here's how it works. So, what happens is you put your coin in a claw machine like anytime you do, there wouldn't be a key here. Put your quarter in there, and what the quarter does is actually hits this, this little hammer right here. And you hit this with the quarter, and boom, the machine's on. And that's how you get the transaction. And then right here is where your quarter would get jammed typically. So, you press this, it literally just kind of recycles everything. You actually have to press it a bunch of times sometimes until the quarter comes out, and then it just lodges down into here. And that is how that works. And how right here, what this is, this is called a door. You grab this, you drop it through there, something goes in, and then it has an ability to go through here, and then you put your hand right in here, and you can grab it. The door. And then, the next thing we got is down here. I know we've all seen these little bottom compartments, and like, well, what's under there, you know? This is not even where the prize, you get the prize from, so what the hell's going on down here? Under here is what powers it. Gasoline. <laughs> This is actually nothing to do with this. We just forgot this was in here. Nothing is under there. This is where the quarter thing is, where it catches the quarters. Then often a lot of people put the extra toys inside there. All right, so the next thing I want to show you guys is actually how the claw works, but we can't get into it because you lost the key to this lock right here. So what we're going to have to do is break it off. Well, Parker's going to break it off because I'm injured. So Parker's going to try and break this thing off like they do in the movies. Like in the movies. Like in the films. Like the movies. <laughs> like in the pictures. If it, really, if it really works that way. He's going to try and hit it with a pickaxe and see if we can break this. Off. If that doesn't work, then I guess the video is done. All right, here we go. We're gonna see if this actually works in the movies. We're gonna use a pickaxe later. If that doesn't work, we're gonna try the uh, axe first and see what happens here. Oh shoot! Oh, <laughs> where my uh, safety goggles? Why don't you want your safety? The safety is number one priority. I've never learned. He chipped the lock. You know what they say? Chip the chip the lock, suck the. All right, so now we're trying the pickaxe. He's gonna use this back flat piece and try and basically pry it to open the. <laughs> Damn, this lock was unbreakable. <laughs> yes, we got it. Okay, well you didn't break the lock actually. You just kind of broke the lock. He kind of just like broke the whole mechanism off actually. I, think I broke the lock. The lock was so weak that everything else took its place. <laughs> okay, so now we're in the machine. So now we can actually get to the toys and show you guys what's underneath here. So if you're at the arcade and you can't get in, just bring a pickaxe. You can get any toy you want. All right. <laughs> I do. Recommend that. All right, now we're finally inside. We can actually look at- Mother of God! <laughs> you finally- I knew you were a good man! I knew you would come back! Let me help! Okay. Oh, yeah! I can smell that free air, man! Get me out of here! My wife! Where's my wife? Where are you at, Petunia? We're finally getting out of here, Petunia. Come on, come on, come on, come on, Petunia. Come on, let's go! <laughs> <laughs> so, we're gonna try and get these animals out of here uh, a little bit. You guys can't come no! out. You're not getting out of here until we break the glass. Like I said, all of you guys are getting out of here in a body bag. So, if you ever wonder what it looks like inside here, I, I really don't know how it works. 
works. I'm not going to try and act like I know how it works. Right here, we think what happened is why it's not working is because of these two cords right here. That's what we theorize, but we don't know. But if you look, everything's like taped together, and that wasn't us. It's just taped together and really like ragtag machine. So I think it was inevitable to break anyway. We have to destroy it. So here we go. Now we just know how it's inside of a claw machine. Now you can really know what's inside of it because we're going to break this thing in half. All right, you ready? I'm ready. So, but I mean, before we do that, are you sure you, like there's nothing else you want to show them? Like we can buttons or the. Anything That's a like good that? idea. I think we can show them the buttons. Um, yeah, you see the mechanism. Maybe the claw would look like a little bit closer. Yeah, we could, like take it apart or something. Yeah, it's a good idea. Where are we going? Right here. What is that? It's bowling, bro. Why do you need that? I'm not showing anything else. Nothing's as interesting as this. Kaioken. That was, I told you it was more interesting. <laughs> that was amazing. That was the best sound ever. Wow. That is literally crumbs. Ready? Ready for this? Oh, man. Oh, that's a good sound. Ready for this? Oh! <laughs> Penelope! I told you! He didn't even remember your name! What the fuck was your name? Dude, this is so fragile. It's crazy. Well, it's fragile now. <laughs> it wasn't fragile before. That was some thick glass, man. Hey, look. I want a bowling ball. That's the best prize yet. Yeah. I could call that a spare. <laughs> <laughs> I call it a strike. Watch this. This is the most satisfying. Come on, come on, come on. Right above me. Come on, this is the most satisfying looking thing ever. Look at this perfectly manicured, shattered glass. Oh. Into nothingness. <laughs> How much would it cost for someone to throw this at your face? A dollar. How much would it cost for you to take this, lay it on your tongue, and chew it like a piece of gum? 50 cents. 50 cents. <laughs> okay, in the comments, guys, how much would it cost for you guys to chew this up like a piece of gum? Let me know down below. Swallow or spit it out? You can swallow. Or you can spit it out? No. No. Daddy, don't play that. <laughs> you know what? I bet you that you can't throw the bowling ball through both panels of glass. Did you see the form? I saw, what? The form? That form I had. I said K.O. Ken, but that shit was a spirit bomb. <laughs> <laughs> I think I can go through like nine layers of glass. I'll, I'll take Nine that. layers of I bet you this dirty dog. Who wants this? Why is this even in the machine? Yeah, like, why is this take a... this oil soaked dog. Why do I have that as an incentive? <laughs> so are you taking the bet? I'm taking the bet. Or are you not taking the bet? I'm, I said I was taking it. All right then, let's see who wins this dirty mutt. But this thing, nothing gonna stop me. Get that ready? form ready. I'll get you. Oh, you, oh, oh my God. <laughs> I told you I could do it. <laughs> wow. That was honestly great. <laughs> that was amazing. I'm glad I lost that. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> listen, listen here. That snap crackle pop. Window crispies. <laughs> uh, dude, you can literally watch them. Like, they're still shattering. All ready? Oh, I'm ready. Coming right through here. Three, two, one. <laughs> Just that little section comes out. I really, really want to punch it. Punch this! When, when did, did you ever- I'll punch? kill you, mother- <laughs> All right, guys, so we didn't know if this was going to be easy to take down or hard, but I just did a gest of messing around hit as hard as I can, and that's all it did. So let me do as hard as I can, see what kind of challenge we're up against here today. <laughs> all that for that. Wow. This is going to be a rough, rough trip. I didn't realize that now. There we go. All right, so Parker came with this demented idea where, <laughs> where we strap some of the plushies on the bag. We have to destroy this thing anyway. That's gotta take some hits. So we're doing a little target practice on King Lion. So you're telling me if I can get through your challenge, you'll save me and my loyal subjects inside? That's what we're telling you. Hmm, that sounds perfect. I don't think I'm gonna go with this one. Who, me? <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you guys later. I missed you guys. Hopefully everything goes good. <laughs> Told you chose this guy, really? He's just a baby. I'm not a baby, I'm a big boy. I just can't wait for this sweet blessed death. Well, I said I didn't need a seatbelt, mommy. No seatbelt, no seatbelt. <laughs> His balls are on my face. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, let me move a little bit. <laughs> Will somebody get this guy out of here? 
All right, here we go. So I'm gonna try and aim for one of them. I'm gonna try and hit probably King Lion first. All right, here we go. Oh, oh no! My little eye! Oh, I want to death! No, don't walk away! Finish me! In the comments down below, guys, here's a comment. Hashtag. Oh! I didn't know this would be how it ended. Yeah. They say when a king lion dies, he goes back to his original primal state. Right. The king is no more. Oh! Ooh. There we go. <laughs> well, you got me. I think I'm dead. And I go out of this world with no regret. Oh, no regrets, huh? <laughs> well, I have regret. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna leave Froggy Fresh. No, no, I don't want to be alive. <laughs> so Froggy Fresh will live on over here. <sighs> you know, I won all my Street Fighter games. Oh. Button mashing. <laughs> Woo! We cleared the button straight through. Oh, that's what I wanted to see with this joystick come through. Oh. There it is. My two-inch tear. Wow, this is actually pretty crazy looking. All that for a joystick. All right, do you think, okay, do you think I'll split this board right here? I think it's just gonna stop. I think it's gonna bend, bend it, you know what I mean? I think it's gonna break it. You know who's holding this hammer? A guy who's injured. King Raptor! Broke it, see? So, I mean, we're kind of both right. No, you're never right, so. I, <laughs> so if, if that's the case, then I'm wrong. <laughs> that came at me pretty fast. That was a challenger. <laughs> All right, you spin this side, I'm gonna act straight through it. Here's Johnny! Woo. Johnny's coming, don't worry. Johnny is still on his way. Johnny is arriving soon. Here's Johnny! Oh, where's everybody? <laughs> I told him Johnny was coming. Like, why does why everybody leave? I thought everyone liked Johnny. <laughs> Johnny's here. All right, go on for your beam. You want to hit it You ready? All right. All I'm right. gonna do this one real hard. So you ready? Been real hard. Oh, oh, nice. Uh, Holy crap. Are you gonna give it a swing? Yeah, I'll give it a little swing ski. Super slam jam. <laughs> oh my, you missed on like everything we do ever. You missed. Oh, the thunder. Oh, don't do it. Don't do it now. Oh, oh, oh. oh that thing is split down the damn center. Holy crap, this thing does not look like it once did. You know it's split. Like split. All right, so we're gonna try and get the actual claw out of here because I think it'll be really cool. We need to cut this wire first so we can get this whole piece out, ready? <laughs> that was all that was holding all that stuff is that one cord. I have a claw. Oh. <laughs> get over here. I'm gonna get that bribe. I'm gonna get that bribe. All right, so I don't really know how else we should do this. Get this thing destroyed even more. So let's fast forward to you guys. It's gonna be other, otherwise it's gonna be kind of boring. We're just, just hitting it over and over and over and over again. So if you got fast forward, you just see the highlight clips. Let's go. Go ahead, it's meditate. Not... Oh! <laughs> Dude, I just went straight through that though. It was like Homer Simpson's hair. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like creepy pasta's fingernails or creepy pasta. Salad fingers? Oh yeah, that thing. You just called salad fingers creepy pasta as a whole. Yeah. Creepy pasta is a genre. People flame them. Flame them. <laughs> nice. Oh, hey man, there is nothing more stress relieving than just being outside with your friend and just, and just breaking stuff. It just, it just you just don't get any more relaxed than this. Pickaxe versus the remainders of the claw machine. Here we go. Ooh. <laughs> oh. That's what I was going for. Damn it. Well, that works. Now you have a little skateboard. <laughs> now I have something to move my furniture. More quarters. Holy crap, I'm just out here breaking stuff. Oh, I made money <laughs> breaking <laughs> stuff. So what if there's more? Dude. What the Oh my god! There's more! Every time I move this, more money comes out. And every time it stops, I beat it up some more. <laughs> <laughs> so I just basically <laughs> dude, this is insane. 
Oh, there we go. There's more money. Ooh, right I, I see another dollar right there. <laughs> there was a whole other dollar inside here. Holy crap. So the moral of this story is if you have an arcade machine, break it and to, to get money. No, the moral of this is everything has money. Start breaking everything. <laughs> <laughs> break anything and everything. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Yes, we have vanquished the claw machine. People said we couldn't do it. But what is this? A man standing among the rubble. We know him as the Ice King. <laughs> now to take out this blasted machine. Otherwise known as a power sword. Oh. Dang. Let's see you trying to fix that. <laughs> Tech support. <laughs> Hello. Tech support. I dialed the number on the back of the machine. I got a little problem. Oh, you don't cover that? Oh, okay. <sighs> I'm finally free from this wooden prison, but now I have no home. All these years, I just wanted to get out. Petunia, Petunia, where are you at, Petunia? Oh my God, Petunia, Petunia, oh my God, get off, animal. Are you all right, my love? Petunia, Petunia, no, now I'm alone with no home. Oh.